why a lot of people keep an orphan on them. I'll do it for this fight, for boss fight. And only certain ones at that. This is actually one of the most fun raid bosses there is in my opinion. It's got some of the simple, some of the real good mechanics of uh, his father, but without the bulk of only being able to damage him through purple spots. I mean that was BS. I farmed it a lot because of the uh, I disappear. So I would get pro essence. So eat. Yeah. I'll show my complete step in detail and ask to why on my spec. Ghost. This I specifically use this version for uh him actually. Playing waste. Uh, freaking Facebook not now. Phases left. This boss fight does take a little bit more than I like. I mean, it is a raid boss. I can't bore him like I can Hyperius, so. I'm actually not complaining about that. Goodbye. Yeah, he's supposed to actually deploy bullets, but four shot prevents that. Four shot completely ignores all bullet deflecting um, but, uh, the least enemies have. So I can shoot in the back or whatever. I don't have to worry. Alright. You know what's gonna happen. He's still got like one or two more phases left. One more after this. Let's get one more health kit, I believe. Take care of some of those markets. They're gonna be a pain or wise. Goodbye. That's all Northway Ammo I'm using. Ghost. Still going with Kunai. Four, baby! He may not thought it was something, dude. I got my kill scout. I disappear. Oh, that's why I didn't use all my Northway Ammo. that kunai get my health back up take us back out of the ground uh, here comes these sav uh, what they call savages they did correct uh, the stuff though and during this steel head our pack actually thought it was pretty cool that they did that Uh, we do need a Grog also. I mean, it's hard I to survive OP8 without one, period. It is possible, but very difficult. As you can see here, I'm staying in Healthgate. Even with, even though I'm using a uh, build that requires me to have a shield up. I wonder why I hold down a few seconds before I... Uh, Release. 
It's strictly because the longer I wait to do the damage, the more damage I do. There he is. You can see why it's my favorite class, why it's my favorite build. I really want to get this build back up to par. I'm popularity and stuff. Yeah, I'll make it less special, I guess, in a way, but. Oh, I'm out of grenades! Missiles back out. One sec. And because I don't have to worry about it as much now, boom. Let's just show you the loot chamber right here real quick. Alright. Um. Well, here's the actual loot I was using. First off. No, wrong one. He's allergic to shock, so I was using a shock hawk. Deep up for some damage against the uh, shock resistant enemies. Northwood to get back up. Um, what's your killer for uh, some of that velocity? Make my bullets fly faster and do more damage. I want to get crit damage just even more so. It also helps with ambush, which is watching from the side even more damage. And a shock relic to increase my shock damage. Uh, chain lightning for the hills. It says slide because, like I said, he doesn't stay slide long enough. I'm going to switch back to my fire stuff because. Uh, yeah. Don't really need our was. B for my damage. Uh. Anyways. So, got this wood pool, which is pretty much nothing. Oh, oh wow, a purple TDR, you piece of <laughs> Anyways. Huh. Sissy Forever One Pistol build. My favorite build in the whole game. Ooh, yay. Well, that's not a character skin, but I'll take it. 
skin I don't have. Uh, this is what people actually will, well, they do for, uh, to try and get the skins and stuff like I'm looking for right now. But it's 20 rooms just to fight the guy. And you don't get enough rooms back to keep fighting him. Trust me. I got farm tubbies and stuff for more radium. Tubbies and little midgets. Thank Norfleet! Except for sourcing my rocket ammo for free. I don't have a shit. Wow, I got a shit while my guns are current. Well, oh, that's character. I don't farm, like I said, I don't farm the bunker for a reason. Every time I do, I break the freaking game. Well, that's one mode instead. Oh, that was a sword. I thought that was a rock launcher for first. Anyways, let's go against Jess now. But, uh, yeah, that was the raid version. Sorry, I looked everything here, didn't I? Yeah, I did. And stuff, uh, y'all got to see a quick side of the build. That is the main build I was using during the live stream last night while playing the assassin. My main mobbing build every day. I use it since I uh, saw it. Fell in love with it. It's amazing. Attack! Not a bad one, I guess, but. What is there really such thing as good attack besides the sword explosion? Bring my money. Now there is a way to glitch into this area without fighting him. Supposedly that increases the chance somehow of legendaries. I don't know. They did the same thing back with the uh, the treasure room. The Captain Scarlet DLC. A long time ago. You a bandit tag. Ugh. Waste my time on that. And stuff. Not my style. I mean, don't get me wrong, I see why people do it and stuff. There's chances of getting loot, yeah. Uh, we'll go, I'll go ahead and finish up the spec. Uh, show, show the build. Again, headshot. Increase crit damage. Kill or increase roll speed, crit damage, or get a kill. What you want to kill that is, well, that's mainly to increase the uh, damage of the infinity. Because it's always like that. Four. You know, shoot three enemies, do more damage. That's always fun to do. Uh, kill confirmed. Again, more crit damage. But even though that's flossy. Uh, full shoot faster. More gun damage and crit damage. If I had fine prefix on my uh, shock hawk, it would be fine even faster. Uh, sadly, no. Fast hands, reload speed, weapon, sp uh, weapon swap speed. Always good to have. You saw I was constantly switching between this and this. So, I mean, fearless, uh, bear fire and gun damage. I don't use it for boss fight. It doesn't really affect me during boss fights and stuff, but yeah. Ambush, you know, I was constantly shooting from the side in the back. I was getting that increased damage. Rising shot, more gun damage. Death mark. That's uh, why it combined with uh, Death Blossom or what everybody calls Kunai. Gun deception, you throw that Kunai on it. They take an extra 80% damage. Uh, Innervate. One deception. I saw it regenerate health. But not really enough to count. But it does give me more movement speed. And it's like more gun damage. I mainly do it for the movement speed. Uh, killing blow. Just because increasing your health makes you take more dot damage. Which is stupid. So, Grim. Wants me to slowly regenerate my shields. That's how I'm. But it, it helps you stay off longer. Trust me. But also gives you back your... Uh, Deception quicker. Uh, part of the brain butter to build for haul through, getting the kill skill, increased movement speed, gun damage, and everything. It's adds up really good. My bar, as you can see here, it's not very high compared to a lot of people's. But yeah, that's the build. That's the gear I was using. Raid version of Sun of Chrome Rex. Enjoy. Thanks for watching.